In this video, I'm going to show you how to change or remove the LCD panel on a Toshiba Satellite laptop. This specific model is a C650. Um, I believe the process is the same for the C660, so it should be a fairly common um, process with these laptops and the main other laptops too. To begin with, I'd recommend taking the battery out. First of all, I'll show you why we're replacing this one. You see soon, big nasty crack. Nobody wants that. Point of impact there. So, put down the battery out. Open the laptop from the front. There's four small covers we want to remove. I use a small flathead screwdriver. This one in each corner. Let's take them off now. Once you have the four covers off, I'm going to switch to a uh, Fill up the screwdriver, fill a small one, and remove the screws. The screws are fairly small, I recommend keeping them to one side. The bezel should now pop off. Just run your fingers around the side, fuse the clips. Bezels off. Stairs to one side, I'm in the kitchen. One more space in the kitchen. Now you want to look to the sides. So, uh, if you look at the sides of the laptop, you can see there's a further, it's normally two or three screws. So, on the Toshiba, I've got three. So, there's one, two, three. And on this side, and again, one, two, three. So, remove those. I don't worry too much about losing the screws, I've got plenty of them. So, when these screws are removed, the screen should now be more flexible, you should be able to move it out. And if we tilt it down onto the keyboard, make sure you can see, we have the ribbon cable. This is the signal. So this is an, an LED panel. An LCD panel with a CCFL um, backlight would likely have an additional connection with uh, a positive negative going in to, to provide power to that. So this connection can be quite fragile. What I recommend doing is just having a little look at the tape around about it. Start to remove that. Again, being careful. And then pull the connection off. Job done. And um, putting it back together is the, the exact same process. You're going to want to put the new screen there. Uh, stick on the, the connection, secure it in place. Uh, if the stickiness is gone off of this, uh, you want to add a little bit of tape on it just to be secure. Put it back into place, three screws each side and then put the bezel back on. Now will click back into place, be quite secure and then you just put the four screws back on around the edges. And uh, that's you. Thanks for watching.